In this video, I show you how to shape and score your baguettes so you can get explosive bloom and open crumb. Please subscribe to me on YouTube and follow me, BreadMD, on Instagram. After dividing your dough into three pieces, the next step is pre-shaping. Here I show you how I pre-shape into a loose roll. First by folding the corners in, rolling and sealing, rolling and sealing once again, pinching the ends so there aren't any sticky bits of dough, then a light tightening against the countertop. The pre-shaped dough is left to rest for 15 to 20 minutes. After that time, flip your pre-shaped dough, seam side up, pat it down lightly with lightly floured hands, and then we're going to do a fold about three quarters of the way down, lightly sealing it, turn it around. Every time we turn it, we lift it and stretch, lift and stretch. This time we're going to fold all the way to the edge. Here we're starting to build some tension in the dough without compressing too much of the crumb in the center, hoping to get nice open crumb. So again, seal it right to the edge. Make sure we get a really nice seal and remember where the seam is. We always want to know where the seam is. Lift and stretch, seam side down. Now, we're not pressing down on the dough. We're pushing it along the countertop to create tension. It also lengthens the dough as it's creating this tension. This tension will allow those great blooms to occur. Finally, we're going to taper the ends. I always do this with seam side down. I notice the left side is a little bit fat still, so I roll that out a little bit. Flip it over, make sure you know where the seam is before you transfer it to the couche, seam side up. Next, we score the baguettes. Imagine your baguette divided longitudinally into three lanes, approximately equal widths. Your score should stay in the middle lane. Ideally, each score should overlap with the next by about one quarter to three quarters. If you don't overlap the scores, the baguette will end up sausage link shaped with lobes. Your blade ideally should be angled at about 30 to 45 degrees from the surface of the dough. This will give you nice ears. If you've managed the fermentation well, shaped and scored well, then you should be able to attain this wonderful open crumb baguette. Thanks for watching.